In this video, we're going to talk about how to use sponsored messaging for an ad in Facebook. Now, one of the things you have to understand about sponsored messages uh, is the fact that a lot of people don't use them and there are selected use cases that work very well for them. So it's just like setting up a messenger ad, but we're going to do something slightly different. Here, instead of click to messenger, we're going to select sponsored messages. And you can see here, this is what a sponsored message is. It's a target message to someone who's already participated with you in a bot messaging conversation. So we're going to pick the page that we're going to use, and you'll immediately notice that the number of people targeted is super low. That's because I don't have a lot of people on this particular page, but it also lets you know that you're going to be focused to a super narrow audience. So it's not going to be massively wide. Remember, you're just targeting people who have responded to you, and you're doing so with a promotional message. You'll notice that there are going to be no placement options because we know we're going to put it right in a messenger conversation. So let me update the budget here. I've seen some people increase this to 300 on a CPM perspective just because it means that they are definitely going to get their message out to everyone on their subscriber list. Okay? The next thing we do, we're going to set up our message the same way, in a similar way that we do with a uh, JSON ad, but it's going to be slightly different. Here, I'm just going to personalize it. Um, and after I personalize it, I'm going to add the quick reply. Now, you can either use keywords in a mini chat bot, or if you're using chat fuel, you'll just use the bot payload and you'll just put the name of the block that you want it to go to. But in mini chat, you're going to do something slightly different, and it's pretty similar to the hack I showed in one of my previous videos um, that's sitting inside our group. But this is what we're going to have our message say that's going to appear in someone's conversation. And uh, we're going to tell them what to, what quick reply to select. You can see how that looks right there. Next, we're going to connect it to our bot. Now, I'm not using keywords. I'm using this sort of dummy pass-through approach that I've talked about in the past. I'm using this particular flow. I'm going to connect to my JSON ad uh, uh, growth tool. I have this block right here, which has one button that's going to push it through to the, to the block or message I really want them to see. So this is going to be my dummy pass-through starting point. And then I'm going to make it go to here, and it's going to say, sweet, you created your discount, now just enter your email below. So you should never see that first block. You're just going to see the second block. All right. So now I'm going to make sure that this is selected as my JSON there. That's selected. So now I'm going to go to the setup. Now here's the interesting thing. We're looking for the payload. So we're just going to copy this. And this is all you have to do. Just copy this. And we're going to paste it right there. Once we paste it right there, that's all we need. So, oh, this says, oh, the pixel is not available. So let me just turn off the Facebook pixel for this one. I'll look into that later. All right. So now we're going to go up here. And so that's what it looks like. That's what it's going to look like in a conversation. It's going to show up in a thread. All right. You'll see sponsored. You hit this one, and this is what it's going to look like in the inbox. So the first characters of this message are going to be super important. All right. So now let's see what it looks like in Messenger. So we're going to preview it in Messenger. Okay, let me get over to Messenger. And there it is. There's the Go button. I hit Go. I'm using the pass-through method. You could use a keyword method. And then, and there you go. Sweet, you claimed your discount. Just enter your email below. I can enter it. You don't see the first message. You just see this one. It's personalized. It's connected to the bot. 
and this is the best way to use a sponsored message. Now I'll just navigate back to here and I'll just confirm this ad and uh, we'll go from there, right? And that's how you use a sponsored message in Facebook and that's how you um, get something targeted to your subscribers, a promotional message targeted to your subscribers. Regardless of what Facebook says about extending the deadline for non-promotional content, this is the best way to do it that makes sense for everyone using sponsored messages. I hope this helps. Have a great one.